Hey you guys, it's Peter and welcome to my channel. Peter. Boom, 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 boom. Review stuff. And I am excited to make this video today because this is not the video that I expected to make. Um, I was going to do my very last, I am so tired of these advent calendars. Oh my God. I cannot get rid of these advent calendars, let me just tell you, okay? I have unboxed so many advent calendars now that I try to put the things back in there and then I <laughs> shove them in a bag and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna give this one to my good Judy Tanya. And then I gave her like three of them and she's like, I'm gonna give them to the girls that were at work. They'll love them. And I was like, you don't even want my advent calendars. Nobody wants them, okay? I got like two of them in the kitchen for the dogs. Someone's in the kitchen with Dinah. And I've been giving those treats to the dogs left and right, okay? So listen, it's gonna be probably Diarrhea Central over here tonight, because I've got so many. We caught up on days today, okay? I felt bad for the dogs. They've been cooped up inside all day because it's cold, so they got, listen, there's Sally Joe and Sandy Joe. We're gonna talk about Sandy Joe and Sally Joe in just a second. Uh, but they got extra treats today, so we're just gonna, I hope that like maybe it just, anyway. I will tell you, okay, if you watch my advent calendar review and you watch my, uh, what's it called, Dapper Dog Box, <laughs> dog, rah, 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 Dapper Dog Box review, my dogs really, really love the treats. Of course they do. But they're kind of particular, each one of them, about the treats. Um, they really like the treats that come in all of them, specifically the Trader Joe treats. They really, really like those, as well as the immunity sticks that came in um, the Dapper Dog Box. Like, our dogs, like, love those. They're called immunity sticks. So, anyway, before I get into that, I do want to talk about Sally Joe for a second. So, um, just because we're going to be talking about some of Santa's secret, you know, work that we don't want everybody to know about because, you know, okay, uh, this might be the time to turn off a video if you uh, have little ones around, I'm just going to say, okay, because I'm going to talk about Sally Joe and Sandy. Do y'all get what I'm saying? Okay, turn it off. Don't the, the children don't need to be in the room for this part, okay? But I have to read this message that you got to you guys that I got on Twitter because it was so endearing to me, and I just want you to know, like, I said this in a, in a video not too long ago, but this this channel came about at a time where I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do on YouTube anymore. And you know, I've been watching YouTube for 10 years. And um, when I used to watch YouTube back in the day, it was just stuff like this. It was stuff people doing favorites and unboxings. And I loved that stuff. Like that was what I watched YouTube for, okay? Not all the crap that's out there today, of which I might participate in on another channel, but we won't talk about Okay, but you know what I mean? Like, that's the stuff that I watch. And this is really, literally, the channel that I always wanted to have on YouTube. I'm having so much fun over here. Um, and I want to say this. I... <clears throat> have really thought about giving out huge gifts, and I may still do something nice. I probably will on the 24th and the 25th, um, because that's Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, and they're, you know, I love Christmas and Christmas Day. Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Uh, but I wanted to do something really not, like one big day, okay? And I didn't know which, which day I was gonna do it on, but my 25th year sobriety birthday is next Tuesday. If you watch any of my videos that day, I'll probably be highly, highly emotional. And I thought, you know, that is the, that is the day I think I wanna do my big giveaway over here. And I don't know what it's gonna be, in all honesty. I don't know what things I'm gonna give away. I haven't even started putting it together yet. But that's the day that I'm gonna pick because A, then people will get things in time for Christmas if they wanna use it for Christmas, if they're gift cards, things like that, you know, or whatever, if they wanna like open their own present. Cause there are people out there, I get messages all the time that literally have no friends, no family, and YouTube is their life. And so, you know, I wanna be able to be part of that and allow them to have something nice at Christmas time. So next Tuesday, okay, will be when I'm doing my big giveaway. So come over here next Tuesday, tell all your friends and family to subscribe or follow, you don't have to. I mean, you don't have to, my biggest hater in the world could win that. But anyway, the reason I'm telling you guys this is because I'm now starting to get a lot of messages about the review channel and people are saying like, you know, how much they love this channel and that they just crack up over this channel and things like that. And um, I'm gonna try to keep the reviews shorter over here. My cousin said she only watches this channel because of the channel, the videos are so short, but now they're getting longer and I wanna keep them shorter. Today's will be longer because I've rambled on so long. But anyway, I got this message yesterday and this is just where I feel just so honored that you guys allow me in your home. And no, this is not a Peterisms or a vlog channel video, but you guys just let me come into your homes and be part of that. And I 
think that's so cool. Like who knew through the power of technology that I'd be able to sit here in my house with my dog sitting, oh, well, Pee the Flying Chihuahua's right here. You know, and Tucker's over there. <laughs> There's Tucker, he always just sits and watches me as I'm making my videos. But who knew, you know, that um, I would be in my house and then all of a sudden you would watch me and yours and be part of that. So when I got this message, I teared up. It cracked me up, but I also teared up and then I read it to my best friend and I read it to my husband as well. So I got this message last night from Stacy. So Stacy, if this is, you know who you are. She said, so love the review channel and try to keep, and try to watch when my kids are asleep. However, dot, dot, dot. My child walked in as you were holding Sally Joe, and he said, uh, mommy, he's holding Chippy and almost cried. I panicked and almost blanked on what to say. Then it came to me. I said, well, you see, this is Peter and he helped Santa with the elves. To my surprise, he believed me and watched the rest of the review with me. That damn elf will be the, de the death of me. Sally Jo, oh my God, okay. And then um, they, th then sh okay, and then um, I said, oh my God, I'm so sorry, poor Chippy, right? And then she responded and said, LOL, no worries, but my son believes you're Santa's helper. And I thought that was so cool, right? And then I wanted to uh, read this email to you. Hold on, I, I just thought about this as I was like doing this. This was actually one of the winners. Um, this is from, uh, I think Cynthia, let me see if I can find it. Hold on a second. Sh Cynthia sent me a picture and this is so funny, you guys. Oh, where is it? Um, well, if I can find it, I'll include it right here. But she said this is <laughs> Sandy Joe's dad. Where did I, where is it? I can't find it. Hold on a second. Um, was, I know it was Cynthia that sent it to me. Okay, so here it is. Here's the picture right here. This is so fantastic. And it says, um, where did she, she put Sally Joe's ex and Sandy Joe's father. And I love that you guys are participating in this. I have gotten so many pictures, you guys, of um, different, you know, like Sally Joe this, and she's doing something funny. People are sending me Elf on the Shelf pictures, and I absolutely love it. So thank you so much for participating in this channel at 6 minutes and 52 seconds. If you're somebody that likes this channel, you'll enjoy that six minutes if not then here we're starting it all right so I was up in the uh, Walgreens today buying all kinds of gift cards I have tons in here for like my next few videos by the way I want to say are you ready Dun -dun 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 -dun. the winner of the $25 Starbucks gift card from two days ago is Miss Tara Osmond. Tara, congratulations. Email me at peterreviewstub at gmail.com, listed below by KTL Records, and I will send that out to you. And by the way, okay, I have slacked the last couple days, but tonight I'm going to be sitting right over there, and I'm going to be sending all of my little Christmas cards out with all the gift cards. So if you have won anything up till today, it will, and you haven't received it, it will be sent out tonight. So you guys are like what is he doing and you will uh, get it in the next couple days please if you are a winner and you, <laughs> winner winner chicken dinner <laughs> if you are a winner please um email me once you receive it so that i know that you got it as well okay so i was in walgreens purchasing those and i was walking out and there was this box at the counter and i was like oh what is this and it was soap and glory and i was at 40 dollars. but if you have a walgreens gift card and you can go in there and you can open a walgreens gift card right now and you get it for 50 percent off so you get this for 20 dollars instead of 40 dollars and i was like this is such a great buy and i really like the brand soap and glory i've used a lot of their brands in the past people have sent me their brands and i really really enjoy them so let me show you this because you know, I think often we don't really know what to buy people, like for Secret Santa gifts or, you know, family members. And I think this is really a universal gift. And I want to go inside and actually see how good the products, I mean, like how big they are, what you get, if it's really worth to me $20 or $40. Because I think this would be a great gift to give somebody. And that is this, Soap and Glory. Here, let me get a little thumbnail. Are you ready? Soap and Glory. Sensation, sensational indulgence box, okay? And it says, treat yourself to a fragrance fave from your very own. And I said to the girl, I said, so how do you know it? She goes, well, everything that's on the cover is in the box. I was like, don't ruin the magic for me. And on the back here, it has listed everything that you get. So I'm gonna read that in just a second. And then it says, for your favorite sensationals all together in one pamper packed, super skin and skin indulgent selection box featuring a body wash, Scrub and butter, a fab bath fitter, plus a trio, <laughs> plus a trio of marvelous face masks. So I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna see if this is worth, I think, twenty or forty dollars. But I think it's a really kind of cool gift. I actually think it's really pretty too. I know it's kind of corny for me to say that, but I do think it's really pretty. You know, so you think I'm really pretty, <laughs> or so you think you're really pretty. 
I mean, when in doubt, make a Mean Girls reference. I don't care if I'm 47, okay? <laughs> Hold on, I'm trying to take this out nicely in case I choose to re-gift it. And Tanya G, she, just, she doesn't care, she'll re-gift. Tanya G re-gifts my re-gifts, okay? How do I get this off of here? Well, I'm gonna have to take this off. So anyway, I think I'll probably keep these. It's Christmas morning, Chippy! <laughs> that mom is like, oh my God, he just woke up. <laughs> Sorry, Stacy. Okay, the box is even cuter. You can take that off, which, and then underneath here, look, and it has this little name tag on it. It says Soap and Glory Seasons, uh, su Season Sweetings. Pee Pee is now down here wanting to see. You want to come up back up here, Pee Pee? He said, I wanted to see what all the treats were about, but he said, I realized they're just facials. Can we do one? We can do one later, Pee Pee. Okay. So there's a little box there, and this is such a cute box. It reminds me of my grandma back in the day. I don't know why. Yes, my grandma that went to prison. Oh my God, if you want to know about my grandma that went to prison, just go watch my vlog. I talk about it over there all the time. Anyway, don't kill me, Caroline. My cousin Caroline's always like, oh my God, our grandma that went to prison. Okay, she did. She went for embezzlement. Oh my God, it smells so good. That's probably why we had such nice Christmases. <laughs> Oh, Grandma, I'm sorry. I love you so much. She used to, my Grandma, like, Caroline's like, how do you remember this stuff? My Grandma, she used to take Caroline and I up in the grocery store. My Grandma, okay, listen. Most of my life, my Grandma was, like, five foot. But when she died, she was 4'10". And my mom used to always shove, like, she would make me drink milk all the time. And she'd say, you better drink your milk. Because a Grandma didn't drink her milk. And she shrunk two inches from osteoporosis. <laughs> my Grandma smoked Salem's like they were going out of sty style, okay? And we would be up in the grocery store. This is back in the day when you could, like, smoke anywhere. Y'all remember those days in the beauty shop? My Grandma went to the beauty shop once a week. She got her hair done. She got, like, one of those little tight, you know, perms. And she got her hair done. She, or her nails done. She always always had like, like, you know, jagged red nails, perfect nails. I remember when she passed away, my aunt was always like, grandma always had the nicest nails. <laughs> she probably did them for everybody when she was up in prison. But anyway, we won't talk about all that. But my grandma, we were in the grocery store one time and this woman, she said uh, to my grandma, my cousin Caroline and I, we were just like walking behind her, you know, and grandma's all hunched over the grocery cart smoking a cigarette. I don't ever remember my grandma not having a cigarette in her mouth, to be real honest with you, or a little Coke or a cup of coffee, because she didn't drink. She was a teetotaler. She didn't like drinking whatsoever. My cousin and I, after everybody died, we found out that my grandfather, actually, that he died when my mom and my aunt uh, were real young, like my mom was four. He was actually a bartender at uh, one of the coolest bars, so they've reopened it in Indianapolis. Um, it is called, why can't I ever remember what it's called? Whenever somebody asks me. Anyway, my cousin knows. It doesn't matter. But anyway, he might have drank a little bit. He still loved Jesus, though. But it doesn't matter, okay? So there's some stories, family stories, and this is a review of this box, and you're probably like, we don't care about all that, okay? But my grandma, this woman said to her, please, my God, don't smoke in the grocery store. My grandma said, why don't you mind your own? She cussed. She could cuss, too. Okay. So this smells a little bit like a grandma. I will say that, okay? Now, I, my grandma, she always did smell good. My mom said, we'd always get my grandma Gina Tay. Do you remember that? But we'd also get her those powder puff things, you know, for her for Christmas and her birthday. My grandma loved powders of all kinds. Okay. Pee-Pee's over here now. He's wanting to smell it. Do you see this? Okay. So it smells really, really good. And this is what it looks like when you open it. You basically get 15 minutes of stories and two minutes of a review. Y'all know that by now, don't you? Okay. So when you open it, the first thing that you get is these face masks. These Soap and Glory face masks. You get this one, which is called Speed Plump. Super hydrating miracle moisture mask, including um, hyaluronic, I don't know how to pronounce that, acid, and pink flower power three. Complex with Rosa. Okay, you get all kinds of stuff. So this is the first one. And it's a full face mask that you put all over your face. And then the next one is a bright and beautiful. She's like this. It does kind of remind me of my grandma's days, like the 50s. Uh, party recovery radiance boosting mask. White flower. Uh, okay, so that's like the next morning when y'all have and taken the spirits too much. Okay, now you don't want to go to Christmas. Listen, okay, to me, boys and girls, I don't drink. Like I said, it's been almost 25 years. But you don't want to go to Christmas, and you don't want to like be drinking up the Boone's Farm, okay? And then the, having the gin and tonic. Look, he thinks he's, he looks like he's in a Christmas present, doesn't he? You don't want to be drinking up the Boone's Farm or the Kendall Jackson or you know what I'm talking about, having those special cocktails, okay? Which basically just means you're getting liquored up, and then start telling everybody truths about themselves. Okay, family Christmas is not the time to do that. Okay, family therapy is the time to do that. Not Christmas. We don't want to turn Christmas into that and then you wake up the next day and you don't know what you said to anybody, okay? Then the next one you get is the Puffy Eye Attack. God, don't you know I need this. Okay, under eye brightening hydrogel patches with Puff E's. So you get those. 
I'm gonna use those tomorrow. PP thinks he's gonna use them, but he's not. Okay, and then the la there's just two more things in here, so I don't know what this is. It looks heavy. <laughs> don't call me heavy. Okay, just don't. The first thing you get is this little uh, bath fizz. It may be true, but you don't go there. Okay, you do. You don't go there. The next thing you get is this little bath fizz. I don't know. How, if, does it say how much it is on the back of here? Can you read that, PP? No, I can't read that. He can't read it either. We both need readers. My God, we're both so old. Anyway, okay. It smells good, so we'll put that over there. That, we'll re-gift that to somebody. Okay, and then the next thing is, <laughs> he wants all the treats. He thinks they're treats. Okay, this is a really nice size. Y'all see this? This is a nice size. And this is the Righteous Body Butter. Um, lost that uh, rubbing feeling. Why not try the Righteous Butter? Because <laughs> like the Righteous Brothers get it. I have not um, ever tried this before. Oh my God, it smells so good. You wanna smell that, pee, pee That smells so, I'm keeping that for me. That is nice. My husband will love this. pee, -pee. they're not T-R-E-A-T-S. -E okay, and then, oh, there's two things in this one. What could it possibly be, pee, -pee? Oh my Lord, okay, let's, oh my Lord. You know what I love about this, I will just say is, that what you get in this box for $20 are all life, life you know, life size, not life size things, but, I mean, they're like ones that you would buy in the, the big ones in the store. I don't know how much these are though each. Let's put a, a soap and glory. Let's put look this up really quick. Soap and glory body butter. Let's see how much it says. Here it is. Oh, it's, well Target it says $4. Ulta Beauty it says $15. 15. Okay, so I don't know which one's 15. Here, let's look it up on Ulta Beauty and see. Oh, that's a bigger one. Okay, so that's 10 ounces. So uh, this must be, how many ounces is this? I don't know, I can't. I got my glasses on, I can't do math, it doesn't say. Um, but I don't know what size this is. It's not the size that is on the picture, so. Um, oh my lord, who, who just came up here? Oh, it's Tucker, hey Tucker. Um, well, it says this is travel size. I don't think I would consider this travel size, maybe. But if this is travel size, this is $4. Um, okay, so then the next thing is the Clean On Me Creamy Moisture Shower Gel Soap and Glory um, with Natural Mandarin Peel Extract and Bonus Built-In Body Lotion. So here it is. I'm gonna turn down that ring light a little bit. There you go. There it is. You guys can see that a little bit better. Oh man, that is really, really nice. Okay, so on here, I'm looking at this right now. This is $12. And then the last thing that you get is, now I think you guys, I think these are like, I think this is like $8. So we're at 20. And then the last thing you get is the scrub of your life. Do you see this? I mean, he thinks there are treats in here. There are no treats. <laughs> we are not doing dog the calendars today, Tucker. He said, but why not? <laughs> but what just happened? <laughs> okay, love experts reveal surefire ways to find the scrub of your life. And uh, the ultimate super soothing, smoothing body butter. Okay, let's see on here. Can you see it, Tucker, where it is? It doesn't say how much it is, does it? So I don't know how much it says. Oh, here it is. This is $12, okay? So already you got 12 and 12, that's 24. And then the three eye mats, so I don't know how much those are, probably two, three dollars each. That's like six. This is actually a really good buy. I think this is a really nice box. And I love Soap and Glory products. I'm trying to look on here to see what I've used before. I don't know what I have used on here before of theirs, but I've used a bunch of their products and I think I did get them at Target. Um, also, I'm reading on here right now at Ulta.com, orders by Thursday, 12, 19, noon. Uh, delivery for 12, 24, free standard shipping over $50. So anyway, um, let's see what this box is like on um, Soap and Glory box. Let's see if you can get it online. Oh, here it is. $20, Walgreens, they have it. Uh, $20, you can get it at Target. You can get all these places. Oh, $40. Um, so, yeah, I think it's a really good purchase. I'm actually going to give this, like, I mean, I wish it would have maybe a couple other, like, small travel things in there. But I think you get a lot for $20, don't you? I really, really do. I'm gonna give this a 4.8 out of um, five. I think this is a really, really good deal with all of this stuff. Yeah, I'm real impressed with this.
So anyway, if you guys have tried this before, you like Soap and Glory, put it in the comment section below and let me know. God, this video is so long. Okay, so now we need to talk about the uh, giveaway. Maybe you won't come back up here. He is like, I am so trying to find treats down there in the bag of uh, gift cards. You, sir, do not need the... <laughs> you do not need these gift cards. Oh my God, I have one, two, three, four, five, six gift cards. Okay, now the one for today, PP, you're gonna pick it out? This is it right here, okay. The one for today, in case you would like to buy something of beauty on Amazon, put your fit is an $25 Amazon gift card. All you have to do below is put what you would love, what cosmetic item, what skincare product, whatever. PB, this is literally a gift card, honey, okay? <laughs> this is not a <laughs> this is not a treat. I know you wish it was, but this is not a treat. Do you wanna hold you wanna be in the video? You wanna go up there and hold it and help it? Okay, come here. He said, I'm gonna help. So if you would like to win, the and Tucker wants to be up there too. If you would like to win the $25 Amazon gift card, what would you buy with it, Tucker? He said, well, I would buy treats. <laughs> if you would like to win the $25 gift card, all you have to do is put in the comment section below what go-to or what big end, high end, whatever, okay? Skincare, cosmetic, whatever product, one product, just one product that you would really like to get for Christmas this year. Um, you know, if it's men, you can put shaving cream or whatever, and then put that in the comment section below and I will randomly pick a winner two days from now. Tara, email me and um, I will get your gift card out to you guys, or out, out to you. And uh, I already looked up her Instagram and she exists, so, um, and she follows me. Anyway, I love you guys and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.